Welcome back to my channel, I'm getting myself better. So it is time for the weekly installment of the Journey to Health Club. So today's question is, what has been your biggest accomplishment on your personal journey? So I guess I'm, I'm going to have to say losing almost 25 pounds um, I haven't done anything in particular this time around that I want to say this time around I mean this particular weight loss journey I've had many <laughs> um, I guess I would have to say losing the 25 pounds because I had gotten to myself to a point where I just didn't want to try anymore. I didn't want to do anything. I had given up. And so to actually put myself in a mindset after a couple of years of just not even trying, not even wanting to try because what's the use, to actually get myself motivated and do it. Um, losing that weight was pretty amazing because I had I honestly I had given up and it wasn't like I had consciously given up at one point I was still trying I just wasn't losing and I wasn't participating in my own destiny because I was cheating all the time and I was justifying it to myself and all these little things add up and so you say you're dieting and you say you're trying but if you're not giving it a hundred percent you're just, you're screwing yourself so yeah actually getting out there since the end of January and losing 25 pounds has been really empowering for me it makes me feel like there is a light at the end of the tunnel and I can do this as far as my lifetime accomplishment on this um, journey um, probably my first half marathon that was huge I spent so much of my life on the couch not moving it was kind of ridiculous I don't feel like it is right now, so maybe I need to. <laughs> Anywho, um, it was a just a phenomenal accomplishment. The first I, I've done four half marathons. The first one was the one I trained the hardest for because I didn't know what to expect. I had no idea what was going to be out there, and I trained and I trained and I trained. Um, still because it's me half-assed but trained more than any of the other half marathons that I've done and it was just a huge accomplishment I cried so hard when I crossed the finish line and got my medal and held it together saw my husband at the end and just bawled for like 10 minutes straight like hard full-on ugly crying like I did this like a lot sad tears but happy tears because I did it so um, I really want to get back to doing something like that again so it's all within me I can do it so I think I'm going to like I said before 
not this November because that's way too soon and I have not trained at all but I think I'm going to sign up for the Vegas half marathon next November it gives me a goal it gives me something to do I mean that that was the ultimate when I was training for that first half marathon I was in the best shape of my life and I was at the best weight not of my life but physically as far as how I looked and felt probably the best of my life it, it was all exercise and good eating which hasn't always been my MO so um, I think I'm gonna sign up again next November so anyway that is my uh, contribution to the journey to health collab this is week number two and I have linked everyone else in the collab below if you're not familiar with this it is like-minded individuals who are and we are all answering questions every week and um, everyone in the collab is pretty fabulous so I think you should check them out so I'm sorry I have I've just gotten back from rehearsal I am drenched in sweat and I am feeling way off so I'm sorry if I'm weird um, but yeah check them all down below um, in the uh, description box and uh, thumb up them and subscribe and do the whole bit because they are worth it and they're awesome and um, they all have different answers to this question so I will see you guys next time